Alright dudes, Duffy112 here. Just a couple of animal scores I picked up. Uh, today is Sunday, uh, August 3rd. Uh, these are from Friday and Saturday. So Friday I picked up these 50 rounds of Blazer Brass 9mm uh, from Fleet Farm. I, I already filed the receipt. Uh, they're like thirteen fifty, which is a great price for 9mm brass. So, And then uh, yesterday, Saturday, Walmart showing 100 round packs of 9mm, still twenty five seventy seven. dollars um, box is kind of damaged a little bit on the corner, so I, don't know, I haven't opened up the box yet. Make sure all the rounds are okay, I'm sure they're fine. Uh, and then Fleet Farm had Critical Defense, uh, Hornady. So I got uh, I got something coming down the pipeline that those are going in. Uh, those coming in 1949 for 25 rounds. And then Cabela's had uh, mini mags on the shelf. Um, these are the 40 grain round nose, of course. And then they had uh, 223 on sale. They had the PMC 223 and the American Eagle 223. Let's go to the ticket. Uh, let's see, I got a beef stick for a buck. Uh, the mini mag was nine bucks. Ouch. And then um, I think that the six ninety nine was the uh, American Eagle, and then six eighty eight. Focus, focus. Yeah, six eighty eight. Those were the PMC. So under seven bucks for uh, for brass two two three for twenty rounds is uh, is. You can't ask for anything better than that for brass. Uh, on a side note, uh, people are talking about the 762 by 39 uh, lately. How the tool ammo isn't uh, you know going to be imported now because uh, the president signed the executive order or anything. And yeah, I mean it's nice to shoot you know nice cheap shit, but uh, I don't know. I'll stick to my brass, American made. I know PMC is not American made, but you know whatever. I'll stick to my brass. So that's it. I. Uh, you know, there's a little teaser. Uh, Tuesday I'm going to be picking up something to put these into, so definitely tune in for that. Uh, I'll do an unboxing. So, well, that's it for today, y'all. Catch ya.